Hello everybody, this is Brian Black here. Welcome back to Let's Play from Star Wars Continuing at the Time. In this episode, we're gonna go through the Douglas Forest. But, but first, let me check something. Okay then, I'll have it
This old tree is really a monster. Here I go. Bring it on. You wasted 
symbol. That's one of my favorite accessories in the game.
This old tree is really a monster. Here I go. Bring it on. captured, I guess. Don't worry. We're not here to hurt you. Then you gotta help me. Let me out of here. What happened? How'd you end up in there? I didn't do anything wrong. <laughs> okay. Is there no one else but you here? No. <laughs> so you haven't seen a girl around here? Her name's Amina. Looks 
like Amina's not here. Let's go. <laughs> Sounds good to me. I'm sick of this brat anyhow. You can say that again. Yeah. That's just plain cold. I'm asking for help. What the? Who are you? Hey, look. The morons are back. My boys are gonna tear you to pieces. Better say your prayers. What did you just say? Hey, when he said my boys, did he mean... Yeah, I think he meant us. I'm afraid so. Huh. <sighs> You're dead mate. Too late to grovel now. There'll be no mercy this time. Get him, boy! <laughs> You don't really want to mess with me. Ah, you way up tonight. Chill out, okay? Yeah. Humanoids located northwest of Aquaria. I'm sure you know there's lots of humanoids in Paterni. Almost all of them are from Sandmite. Huh. But it's strange to find a Benedix around here. Everyone knows they almost never come down from their highlands. Well, you see, miss, it's kind of complicated. Complicated? Yeah, right. Why did the bandits capture you? That's a secret. You know, a real man has things he can't even tell his girl. Huh? Secret? After we just saved your tail? What an odd kid. Let's leave him. I really don't want to hear his story anyway. Uh, huh? We're not interested. Uh, oh, but I really want you to hear about it, miss. I really do. Somebody stop me before I wring this brat's neck. So? Why'd they capture you? A dare. A dare? Yep, that's right. You see, me and my gang are enemies with this other gang back in Safari. I challenged their leader to a dare to see who was the bigger man. A dare, huh? What was it that you did? A test of courage. We dared each other to slip into the legendary Moonshadow Clan's hideout in Douglas Forest and steal the treasure therein. A test fit the real men. I see. You see, you screwed up and got caught. Shut up, moron. So, now we know how you got here. Be more careful on your way home. Later. What do you guys come here for, anyway? Not to clear out the bandits, I guess. We're looking for someone. Looking for someone? A girl? Huh? Yeah. Give you a hand, you big lummox. Besides, I know this forest much better than you guys do. Thanks for the offer, bud. Huh? You're gonna refuse an offer from someone as irresistible as me? You're up to something, I can tell. You really gonna help us? <coughs> as I thought. Let's hear the truth. What do you really want? Oh, uh, well, miss, you see, I, uh... Go on, you won't get angry. No, I haven't exactly gotten the treasure from that bear I made, you see. Treasure? That's right, moron. It's 
a golden statuette. Well, what's stopping you? Go get it. Well, I would if I could, but the bandit's leader has it. And all I know is he's somewhere here in the forest. I get it. So your plan is to leech on to us and hope you get lucky, and we'll get that treasure for you. Uh, that's one way of putting it. Well, why not? We might need some help after all. Are you out of your mind? It's been some time since Amina collapsed in the forest. We need to find her soon and bring her back to town. If this little guy really knows this area as he says, he could guide us. Well, I suppose. That's right. Okay, what now? Roger, was it? So you'll help us out? I owe it to you guys. <laughs> Just leave it to me. Yeah, but what about that there? You're not done yet, are you? Uh, Don't tell me you forgot. Does it really matter? I mean, you guys are searching for someone in the forest, right? So, that means we might run into the guy I'm looking for. I'll help you guys find that girl. And if we run into the bandit leader, you guys can help me slap him down. <laughs> that way, everyone ends up happy. Okay, let's hurry. Go, go, go!
One second, folks. Hi, right, guys. I'm back. Sorry about that. One second.
Right there. You don't really want to mess with this. <laughs> breathing, but 
I don't think her chances are good. Let's get her back to town, quick. Oh. oh. See you guys later then. Glad we found the girl. Thanks, we really appreciate your help. Don't sweat it, one good turn deserves another. She's home safe, thanks to all of you. Ah, uh, it was nothing. No, no, the doctor said that had you found her much later, it might have been too late. Oh, I feel so sorry for the poor girl. She lost both of her parents and now this disease. Ma'am? Oh, it's all the war's fault. If it wasn't for this war, Amina's parents wouldn't have died and she could have lived in peace. That's why the killing has to end. Indeed. But there's not much we can do. All we can do is make wishing charms and pray that Abris ends the war. If only I had the power, I'd smash those airy cliff scum into little pieces. you back here after you collapsed. You collapsed on top of the mountain, Amina. I couldn't carry you all the way home, so I came back to get help. But that's when I saw this boy. I see. Faith, everyone thank you very much. I am so sorry for the trouble I've caused you all. Nah, don't worry about it. He's right. You just concentrate on resting up and getting better. Okay. And Amina? Yes? I asked that doctor to take care of you for me. If you start feeling worse, go see her right away. But how will I pay her? That's not a problem. We've already come to an agreement about the fee. It's all taken care of. I... I can't let you do that. You need to learn to take favors when they're offered. Don't worry. You don't owe me anything. That doctor is an old friend of mine. I'm happy to use my connections to help. She's right. Listen, she says it's okay, so it's okay. But... How about this? Just think of it as payment for the maiden of Arisa. Does that sound fair? That was a gift. Come on, just say yes. You want to see your friend again, don't you? You'll need to get better as fast as possible if you want to do that, right? I don't know how to thank you. Don't mention it. Think? Yeah. Amina, sorry, but we have 
to go. You do? I'd like to stay and help you get better, but there's something important I have to do. It's something I've thought about a lot. At first, I was just going to run away from it all. But then I realized, sometimes you're the only one that can make a difference. And if it's something that might help people, you've got to give it a try. Yes. Wait, you don't mean... That's right. I'll cooperate with you. Of my own free will, of course. So let's go. Before I change my mind again. Uh, okay. You're as easy to read as always. I'll take that as a compliment. All right. We have to go now. I'm sorry, ma'am. Please take good care of Amina. I will. You folks take care of your own work, whatever that may be. Leave Amina to me. Thank you. Fate? Huh? I'll see you again, right? Yes, you will. I'm looking forward to it. I am too. Take care. Yeah. So, whatever happened to that precious UP3 you used to worry about all the time? Uh, yes, well, I've made up my mind. I'll do whatever it takes to end this war. That's all. There are things I can do that no one else can do. If there's a chance, I can help. Cool, kid. Very cool. Either way, we've interfered so much already, it's not going to make any difference, is it? And there's no guarantee we'll ever get off this planet. Making a virtue of necessity, huh? Is that wrong? I have to do something if I'm ever going to get out of here and find my dad. You got the right idea. And I think you could use a little gung-ho, you know? You think? Well, that's the way I prefer to do things anyway. All right, let's go. She's waiting. you long enough. What were you talking about? Oh, nothing. I was just asking him if he's gonna miss Amina. Silly question. Of course he will. Lay off the teasing, all right? It's not like we're going out. Jeez. <laughs> oh, yeah. About the doctor? Thanks. Don't thank me. I was just doing... What I wanted to do. But... Actually, that doctor is one of my subordinates. You mean like Tynave? Well, they're not all doing the same thing. But they are all agents of Aquaria. Mm. And they help me out when I need it. How nice. Just the same. Please accept my gratitude. I said don't worry about it. What is it? Can I really believe what you said back there? About what? That you'll do what you can. I take that to mean you'll cooperate with us? Yes, I will. Huh. Well, I welcome your change of heart. I'll have to thank Amina and her friend. But are you really sure about this? I'm just going along with what he decides. Right. I've made up my mind. In that case, thanks in advance. You're welcome. Now, let's get to Aquios. All right.
Alright guys, that's all for this episode of Let's Play Star Wars until the end of time. In the next episode, I'm going to show off the Waddle and Mumina side quest. This is Brian Blackner. I thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.